Good morning, Half-Heart family, and welcome to Tuesday Morning Prayers, Tuesday of Holy Week. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Prayer in honor of the Holy Face of Jesus. Tuesday. O Almighty and Eternal God, look upon the face of Thine only begotten Son, Jesus. We present it to Thee with confidence, to implore Thy pardon. The all-merciful Advocate opens His mouth to plead our cause. Hearken to His cries, behold His tears, O Father God and through his infinite merits, hearken to him when he intercedes for us poor, miserable sinners. Amen. Prayer for mercy for the poor souls in purgatory. Have mercy, O gentle Jesus, on the souls detained in purgatory. Thou, who for their ransom did take upon thyself our human nature and suffer the most cruel death. Pity their sighs and their tears shed when they raise their longing eyes towards thee, and by virtue of thy passion alleviate the penalty due for their sins. May thy blood, O tender Jesus, thy precious blood, descend into purgatory to solace and refresh those who there languish in captivity. Reach forth thy hand to them and lead them into the realms of refreshment, light, and peace. Amen. Divine Heart of Jesus, convert sinners, save the dying, set free the poor souls in purgatory. Amen. The Traditional Stations of the Cross by St. Alphonsus Liguori My Lord Jesus Christ, you have made this journey to die for me with infinite love. So many times I have sinned, but I repent sincerely because I love you. Pardon me, my God. I will love you all my life. First Station Jesus is Condemned to Death We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Jesus after having been scourged and crowned with thorns, was unjustly condemned by Pilate to die on the cross. Jesus, it is because of my sins that you are going to die. Through the merits of your sorrowful journey, help me in my journey to heaven. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again and to love you always, and to do your will. The Second Station Jesus is made to bear his cross. We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Jesus in making this journey with the cross on his shoulders, thought of us and offered for us to his Father the death that he was about to undergo. Jesus, I embrace all the suffering that you send to me. Through the merits of your pain in carrying your cross, help me to carry my cross with patience and resignation. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again 
and to love you always and to do your will. The Third Station Jesus Falls the First Time We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Jesus fell for the first time under his cross. He had been scourged and had a crown of thorns on his head, and the soldiers hit him. He was in so much pain he could barely walk, but he had to carry the heavy cross. Jesus, the weight of my sins adds to your suffering and makes it infinitely worse. Through the merits of your first fall, deliver me from falling into mortal sin. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again, and to love you always, and to do your will. The Fourth Station Jesus Meets His Mother We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Jesus met his mother Mary along his journey. They loved each other so deeply. Jesus, through the sorrow and joy you had in meeting your mother Mary, help me to be truly devoted to her. Mary, help me to remember in my heart the suffering your son underwent for me. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again, and to love you always, and to do your will. The Fifth Station Simon Helps Jesus Carry His Cross We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. When the Jews saw how weak Jesus was, they feared he might die on the way, before he was crucified. So they forced a man named Simon the Cyrenian to carry the cross behind our Lord. Jesus, I accept the cross that you give me, and I accept how you want me to die. I offer all my sufferings and troubles to you. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again and to love you always and to do your will. The Sixth Station Veronica Wipes the Face of Jesus We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. A woman named Veronica, seeing Jesus suffering so much, and sweat and blood dripping down his face, gave him a towel to wipe his face. By a miracle, he left an image of his face on the towel. Jesus, your face was once clean and good to look upon, but blood and sweat disfigured it, and Veronica wiped your face clean. My soul was once clean and beautiful when I was baptized, but sin disfigured it. Through your suffering, wipe my soul clean. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again, and to love you always, and to do your will. The Seventh Station Jesus Falls a Second Time We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. 
Jesus fell the second time under the cross. The fall renews all the pain in his body and makes his head throb. Jesus, so many times have you forgiven me, and so many times have I sinned again. Through the merits of your second fall, help me and preserve me in your grace until I die. Help me to call on you every time I am tempted. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again and to love you always and to do your will. The Eighth Station Jesus Meets the Women of Jerusalem We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. These women wept with compassion at seeing Jesus walking to his death. But Jesus said to them, Weep not for me, but for your children. Jesus, I am sorry for all my sins, because of the pain and sadness they cause you, who loves me so much. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again, and to love you always, and to do your will. The Ninth Station Jesus Falls the Third Time We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Jesus fell for the third time. He was so weak, and the soldiers pushed him to walk faster, but he could barely move. Jesus, by my weakness and temptation, you are going to Calvary. Give me strength to conquer temptation. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again, and to love you always, and to do your will. The Tenth Station Jesus is Stripped of His Garments We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. The soldiers snatched Jesus' robe off him. Jesus, help me to strip my soul of bad habits so I can give all my love to you who are so worthy of all my love. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again and to love you always and to do your will. The Eleventh Station Jesus is Nailed to the Cross We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Jesus was thrown down onto the cross. He stretched out his arms and offered his life to the Father for our salvation. The soldiers nailed him to the cross and pushed the cross to stand up. Jesus, keep my heart. Keep me always close to you. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again and to love you always and to do your will. The Twelfth Station Jesus Dies on the Cross We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. After suffering for three hours on the cross, 
Jesus gave up his life to the Father and died. Jesus, through my sins, I deserve to be punished, but your death is my hope. Through the merits of your death, give me the grace that when I die, I will die as you want me to. I entrust my soul into your hands. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again and to love you always and to do your will. The Thirteenth Station Jesus is taken down from the cross. We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Two of Jesus' disciples took Jesus down from the cross, and Mary his mother held him close to her heart. Mary, sorrowful mother, pray to your son for me. Jesus, you have died because you love me. Help me to love you always. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again and to love you always and to do your will. The Fourteenth Station Jesus is laid in his tomb. We adore you, Christ, and we praise you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. The two disciples and Mary laid Jesus in a tomb. Jesus, you rose on the third day. Through your resurrection, make me rise glorious on the last day to be always with you in heaven, praising and loving you. I love you, Jesus. I repent of my sins. Help me to never sin again and to love you always and to do your will. Jesus, I kneel before you and ask you, fill my heart with faith, hope, and charity, with true repentance for my sins and a firm desire of amendment. God has loved us from all eternity, before we existed, before he created us, before he created the world. He loved each of us already. From all eternity, God loves us. Stabat Mater Dolorosa The sorrowful mother was standing. At the cross, her station keeping, stood the mournful mother weeping, close to Jesus to the last. Through her heart, his sorrow sharing, all his bitter anguish bearing, now at length the sword has passed. Oh, how sad and sore distressed was that mother highly blessed of the sole begotten one. Christ above in torment hangs, she beneath beholds the pangs of her dying glorious son. Is there one who would not weep, whelmed in miseries so deep, Christ's dear mother to behold? Can the human heart refrain from partaking in her pain, in that mother's pain untold? Bruised, derided, cursed, defiled, she beheld her tender child, all with bloody scourges rent. For the sins of his own nation saw him hang in desolation till his spirit forth he sent. O thou mother, 
fount of love. Touch my spirit from above. Make my heart with thine accord. Make me feel as thou hast felt. Make my soul to glow and melt with the love of Christ, my Lord. Holy Mother, pierce me through. In my heart each wound renew of my Savior crucified. Let me share with thee his pain, who for all our sins was slain, who for me in torments died. Let me mingle tears with thee, mourning him who mourned for me all the days that I may live. By the cross with thee to stay, there with thee to weep and pray is all I ask of thee to give. Virgin of all virgins blessed, listen to my fond request. Let me share in thy grief divine. Let me, to my latest breath, in my body bear the death of that dying son of thine. Wounded with his every wound, steep my soul till it hath swooned in his very blood away. Be to me, O virgin nigh, lest in flames I burn and die in this awful judgment day. Christ, when thou hast called me hence, be thy mother my defense, be thy cross my victory. While my body here decays, may my soul thy goodness praise, safe in paradise with thee. Amen. Prayer to Our Lord on the Cross My crucified Jesus, mercifully accept the prayer which I now make to thee for help in the moment of my death, when at its approach all my senses shall fail me. When, therefore, O sweetest Jesus, my weary and downcast eyes can no longer look upon thee, be mindful of the loving gaze which I now turn on thee, and have mercy on me. When my parched lips can no longer kiss thy most sacred wounds, remember then those kisses which I now imprint on thee, and have mercy on me. When my cold hands can no longer embrace thy cross, forget not the affection with which I embrace it now, and have mercy on me. And when, at length, my swollen and lifeless tongue can no longer speak, remember that I called upon thee now. Jesus, Mary, Joseph, to thee I commend my soul. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer thee the wounds of our Lord Jesus Christ to heal the wounds of our souls. Amen. To Mary, Queen of Martyrs, for the resignation in tribulation. O Mary, Queen of Martyrs, Mother of God, and my most loving Mother, humbly prostrate at thy feet, I dedicate myself to the compassion of thy sorrowful heart, which was plunged into such an abyss of woe and humiliation, and at the same time was such a prodigy of meekness, of patience, of charity, and of all virtues. O beloved Mother, this sacrifice of thy heart was offered to show me the immeasurable price of humiliations, to teach me that I too must take up my cross and follow my Jesus in the way of suffering, which is the true way to heaven. Alas, until now I understood it not, and instead of following Jesus, I separated myself from him 
to run after honors and pleasures. Henceforward, it shall not be so. I will follow him, bearing whatever crosses he may be pleased to send me. I will imitate thee, the true model of invincible patience. I will accept tribulations with Jesus and thee, to be united with him crucified and with thee, and that the more, because my sins were the cause of thy sufferings and his. But thou knowest my enemies never cease from attacking me and laying snares before me to lead me astray from the royal way of the cross. Do thou, therefore, O tender mother, strengthen me, sustain me, and ever keep before me both thy sufferings and the example of thy fortitude. Obtain for me that I may ever have a lively faith, a firm hope, and an ardent charity, and that, being comforted by the remembrance of thy sorrows, I may willingly accept the chalice of my tribulations, thus faithfully and cheerfully to accompany Jesus in his sufferings, and in the great passage from time to eternity, do thou assist me in a special manner. Deign to come with me to my aid. Obtain for me that I may invoke thine and his most sweet names, saying with my lips and my heart, Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, assist me in my last agony. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, may I die with thee in peace. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. O Mother most sorrowful, pray for us who have recourse to thee. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please remember to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you never miss a prayer with us. And support the channel's mission to take these powerful prayers to more hearts and souls by sharing this video. God bless.